Good morning, welcome back to another video and today we are going to be talking about the Yummy Yummy No Me or the Revive Revive Fruit. Let's go! So the Revive Revive Fruit or the Yummy Yummy No Me has been consumed by Mr. Brooke who is a skeleton and that is because of the Yummy Yummy No Me's Devil Fruit power which gives the ability to revive once you have been slain. Basically this is kind of like one of those devil fruits that when you eat for the first time it does nothing until you actually die and then you become a ghost like spectre type thing and you have to go find your body. Once you have found your body you have revived again but in Brooke's case he took so long in the Florian Triangle his body turned into a skeleton but this is absolutely cool as hell because no matter even if your body is a skeleton you still come back to life. like. It, your body could be decayed, but you, you're you completely fine, in all honesty. You just come back as a skeleton. Now, the Yummy Yummy No Me's power is relatively simple. It just brings you back to life. But there is extra moves in which Brook utilises in his Devil Fruit. He, is, he has the ability to actually make his spirit come out of his body again and go back in, in basically in and out, as many times as he wants. But... <clears throat> But by careful examination of this devil fruit, it, his actual ghost form doesn't actually fully separate from his body. Um, basically, it still has to be attached. But this is actually quite handy as basically he is able to go fix stuff that he couldn't normally do like in the Fishman Island up where him and a load of the Straw Hat crew are trapped inside a cage. He is able to go out as his spectre form and pretty much go find someone to come help. This is really, really useful as as they would have been pretty much dead if he couldn't have gone and help, got someone to come help them. That being the case, Brooke, uh, with this devil fruit, actually makes him... <laughs> because he's decayed so much, but he's still a skeleton, this is kind of the devil fruit, kind of. But he actually can't feel the cold or, like, heat. He doesn't actually feel anything along with that. So that is kind of a little bit of a bonus, even though he doesn't have flesh anymore or nerves or anything. But it really does help if he actually is trying to fight. He does feel fatigue, though. That is one thing that happens to him. But to be honest, everyone gets fatigued. So I'm guessing the fatigue comes from when he's actually using his spirit like he gets spirit fatigue, I suppose that's the case. Now this, all in all, this devil fruit is actually really, really handy, and he util and he utilizes this really, really well in most of the arcs. I personally, it goes really well with his skill set as he is a speed swordsman, pretty much. And I, this is not yet confirmed, but he is able to use a thing called Soul Solid, where where it's kind of like his his where he says soul, it kind of gives rise to the belief that he's using his soul to create a frozen blade of power, basically. And pretty much, this could be another adept, this could be another move used by the Yomi Yomi no Mi, but at the end of the day, this is not yet confirmed and merely speculation. Now that is all I've got to say for the Yummy Yummy No Me or the Revive Revive Fruit. I just personally think this is actually a quite a useful devil fruit once you're dead. <laughs> so, if you wanted this devil fruit, pretty much just wait to die. Pretty much. And of course, I'm also working, guys, on a second part of the what are the revolutionaries up to in the actual reverie arc. So look out for that in the next couple of days. So that being the case, guys, have a lovely rest of the day, and I shall see you in the next video tomorrow. Bye-bye.